Bible Church, Pastor Jason here. I'm standing in Sacred Heart Cemetery here in Violin. And I'm reminded as I look across the cemetery like any of us would do, we see the American flags and those American flags represent individuals who have served our country. But this weekend is a remem reminder of the individuals who gave their lives for this country. Now, if you would go to Arlington Cemetery, you would see hundreds and thousands of crosses of men and women who gave their life fighting for the freedoms that we have today. I can remember growing up, my brother and I would be taken by my father to a cemetery as we were riding bikes or doing something, and my dad would remind us, hey guys, always remember that freedom isn't free. My father was an ex-Marine, a Vietnam vet, so we were brought up with understanding what freedom cost. We, were un we understood what the flag meant for us. And so, as you think about this weekend, remember, take time to think and remember and have your children and family that the reason why we have this day, the reason why we have the freedoms that we have is because of hundreds of years of men and women fighting to remain free. And so as we get together with friends and family, as we eat and, and play games this weekend, let's not forget those men and women who gave them themselves so that we can have this holiday. And ultimately, brothers and sisters, we are so grateful that, that we have a Savior who gave the ultimate sacrifice so that we could have redemption, could have forgiveness of sin, and ultimately a home in heaven. Have a great Memorial Day weekend. God bless and be safe. They are more than just names. More than blocks of stone set in rows. More than memories. They are our brothers and sisters. Our parents and our children. Friends, loved ones, and even strangers who believe that we were worth fighting for that we were worth dying for. They stand for justice, for courage, for heroism and fearlessness in the face of danger. They stand for the brave men and women who selflessly answered the call and gave their very lives for the cause of freedom. Let us never take their sacrifice for granted, but instead remember with gratitude those who have served. Today, tomorrow, and every day thereafter. By the grace of God, if we walk upon free soil, if we breathe in the sweetness of liberty, let us give thanks. Let us honor the fallen and let us never forget.